In this tutorial, we are going to go over dictation. Let's say that for one reason or another, you were unable to run Scribematic in the background of one of your patient visits. With this feature, you can simply dictate. We're going to dictate about our patient, Henry. I will create this note about Henry and make a couple of mistakes in the dictation. Because it is AI, you can make as many mistakes as you want. You can repeat things, say things multiple ways, and it will still format a note. Make sure that you explain the patient's history. The AI will be looking for a patient history in most of the options you have for dictation. Henry presents to the office today complaining about persistent headaches and occasional dizziness. He says they are more severe in the mornings. They have been increasing in intensity recently. He denies a history of trauma or injury. He reports that his stress has increased. In the physical examination, everything was unremarkable except that his blood pressure was 150 over 95. The assessment is that he likely has tension headaches exacerbated by stress, but need to rule out other causes due to the hypertension. The plan is to order a CBC, have a blood pressure check next week, recommend stress management, and prescribe naproxen for headache relief. When finalizing a dictation, you are presented with several options. The AI will use the transcript of the dictation to write notes in different ways based on your choices. You can read exactly which choice does what by hovering over a box. We recommend checking several boxes at the same time. That way, if the AI goes in a direction with the note that you don't like, you will have several options to save editing time. You can also dictate a referral letter here. 